you doing here? Yeah, hey, welcome to my vlog. This is gonna be Project Ford. And guess what I'm working on again? The escape. Well, it's got the flex pipe. Going back to the resonator that's got a big old hole in it. <clears throat> but uh, I've got to replace that today. So stay tuned. All right. Oh. Well, I've been under here for about a half hour or so. Because I've just discovered that my, the camera's been in time lapse the whole time. So, this is where I'm at. Um, I cut off the, I cut off this back one, of course. Um, using a semi-metal um, blade, use the hammer and the chisel. This was on this side over here, so what I did is I chopped it off, straight off. This one was up. This end is actually in the uh, exhaust manifold, and uh, I tapped that so I broke the pressure off of this, and I was able to pound it pound it off and then this has come off now so that's where I'm at um, as you can see right in here that's where it right down at the bottom is where it's gone um, and the big the big deficiency is the fact that the uh, um, cable covering is is rusted is rusted completely off I think it's because it's because uh, of the heat I don't know probably going into the cat because it's going into the cat but I don't have a new one yet um, I believe this is a 13 13 or a 14 inch length on that but you're catching me at the end here other than uh, putting the new one on so uh, I'm like working in the uh, working in the water and stuff but Ah, oh, man, okay. Let's get stuff out of the way. Um, I believe that's a two inch inner, inner diameter ID. Check here in a second. Get this stuff away. Oh, dude. I believe it's a two, two inch ID. Oh man. No, Paul. This video is gonna go straight into the other. I just do, oh. What are we doing there? I believe it's a two inch ID. Yeah. 
It's two inch, or two inch OD. Two inch. Two inch will do it. And uh, how long are the pieces I cut off? But 12, 13, I'd say about 14. About a 14 inch length on that. So it takes, takes care of that. Um, next, next project on this thing. Get back down. Get that out of the water. Uh, um, oh yeah, and as you can see, I got the I got the uh, ramps under the rear with the uh, with the jack holding it up. That gave me plenty of room to work under it and as you can see here's the resonator and uh it's got a big old hole in it so that'll be the you know all going through and that'll uh be my next next project and that's going straight into that coming out of the catalytic converter going back Actually going back to the muffler. So uh, that's gonna be the next next project. Um, and again, the thing with this is uh, it's the end of February going into March. The snow's, snow's going away. Which means no more salt on the ground. So that'll mean it's time to be time to take this off the road again. And then put the Mustangs back on the escape and the explorer will come off for the summer so but uh there's always always something going on with the older vehicles and uh if you don't do it yourself it's going to cost you a bundle and uh after a while you'll be working on it so much that the uh uh if you're doing it yourself the cost savings is going to be <laughs> probably the value of the vehicle itself so anyway all right thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and uh actually this will be a continuation so there go it's uh i've actually got the exact same same one here i just gotta get it on there and get them tight it will be good and that was considered the, what was this considered? 10 inch actually, 10 inch two. Let's get this back installed. Uh. <laughs> correct myself um, that is actually the muffler and that back in the back is actually a resonator but <laughs> I don't know I, they had a back backwards so um, I don't believe that's a freaking muffler I don't know what they were doing that is a resonator that's not a muffler it kind of got me all jammed up There. <clears throat> and this is gonna go right down. All right, sweet. Let me pound that, pound that puppy back up in there. Are you jet? This is getting awful weak here. Not a good thing. I'm gonna start putting my rubber one over there. <clears throat> Use a rubber, use a rubber mall on that. 
give me that. Um, ratchet. Um, two inch. All right. Fifteen. Where the heck is my fourteen? <laughs> Guess what? It's a fourteen. And I'm missing a fourteen. Uh, I'm wearing some more. Where am I missing fourteen? There we go. Ah, what am I doing? Ah. back in there. What is this one? Seven eighths, you're even in the wrong freaking category. Um, D. Deep 13. Damn, I'm missing some, I'm missing some deep stuff. Ah. It's 13. I'm missing a lot of sockets. I don't know where the heck they're all going. Yeah, nine sixteenths. Might even be a nine. Yeah, nine will work. <clears throat> You're nine deep, dude. All right. Man, I gotta tell you, getting down in the thirties, you gotta wear glasses or uh, gloves. Oh, I just keep my hands warm. I land on my phone. Right. Get this on. Get the hammer over. <clears throat> what did you do to him? <laughs> there you go. Alright. Okay, let's get this. <sighs> oh. what I did is uh, I found a old piece of a hanger that I had kicking around and I put it through the original rubber hanger and then uh, I clamped it I clamped it right to the the pipe itself so now I've actually got dual hanger got a hanger over here and then I got the other hanger on this, and that's taking the weight or the stress off the off the flex instead of having the flex taking up weight. Um, even though this side here was taking up um, quite a bit of the quite a bit of the weight, but it was a lot of weight being. Uh, um, um, hanging actually off of the the flex pipe itself um, the flex is supposed to flex when the motor when the motor shifts and stuff like that it's not really meant to hang the catalytic and the exhaust off of it so the more um, <clears throat> the more hanger you have to keep the um, exhaust off the thing and I've actually got it up higher than it than it was before um, because I guess eventually the uh, it stretched and then the muffler started to hang down uh, but uh, all right so I'm done that takes care of that in a dual uh, dual hanger on both sides <clears throat> thanks for watching don't forget to comment 
and uh, you'll catch me on the next project. There you go. Escape. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Thanks again.